Lately, have you had thoughts of putting a full stop to every single thing in your life? And were you unable to make sense of anything or you didn't receive a comforting hand or a smile which could have eased you from your utter brokenness and desolation? Remember, you are not alone. Come, let us pray together to find a hopeful future as we journey with St. Ignatius during this novena. A reading from the prophet Jeremiah For I know the plans I have for you, declares the Lord, plans to prosper you and not to harm you, plans to give you hope and a future. The Word of the Lord St. Ignatius of Loyola wanted to put a big full stop to everything in his life during his sojourn at Mandresa. He strongly felt to end his life. He acknowledges this in his autobiography. But God had other plans. He drew a line above that full stop and made it into an exclamation mark. This exclamation mark is the hope. No matter how sinful we are, the Lord comes to us even when we are lying in our tatters of brokenness, in a state of complete desolation and depression, and converts our full stops into exclamations. This is hope. St. Ignatius of Loyola and other saints are emblems of this hope. Do we let God to bring us a hopeful future, just like St. Ignatius of Loyola? Let this question be anchored deeply into our hearts as we journey in this novena with St. Ignatius of Loyola. We pray for all the young people that they find a hopeful future while they face many obstacles in the journey of life. Lord, the glimmer of hope and life, shine forth your love and grace upon us. You are our hope and future. So, we seek your blessings to enlighten us to brighten our future. O oh Lord, make us optimistic about our future, which reduces feelings of helplessness, increases happiness, reduces stress, and improves our quality of life. Thus, may we have a better understanding of hope and life as good Christians. We make this prayer through Christ our Lord. Amen. <laughs>